Hi, we're back. Today we're going to take it slow. We're going to kind of just play around a bit. Um, nothing really in mind, just kind of, I think, what creates the best result when you don't have any expectations. So that's what we're doing today. I am still feeling so tired. So if I look it, <laughs> I woke up today and I thought to myself, I have a blonde wig that deserves a makeup look. And I'm like, today, that is what I'm going to be doing. That's what I'm going to film. I have this stunner. Oh, can I just sleep? This beautiful um, synthetic wig that looks really real, actually. It's from Hair Spells. I already have a video with them um, put up with the other wig, but this is their second wig, and I don't know which I prefer because this is a gorgeous, 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 gorgeous blonde wig um, that I'm really, really excited to try on and play around with. It does have a dark shadow root. I'm not too sure about that at the moment. I don't know if I if I like it or not. So yeah, I got this wig and I thought that a makeup look solely dedicated to it is showing the highest form of appreciation to your wig. Anyways, I am going to be linking this down below in the event that you want to check it out yourself. I do have a coupon code that you can try out. Um, so if you do want to check out their entire store or whatever, you are going to have a coupon code that you can use I'm gonna just put this wig on, I'm gonna pop it on, so then we'll have something to work with. Needs fixing. I'd recommend you do this part off your head, but. Sweet. I am not going to be gluing this down because I can't be bothered, plus it's like pretty flat on my head. Okay, the wig is on, I'm covered in so many hairs that is not my own. So it's time to start the makeup look. <laughs> I'm aiming for kind of bronzy, freckled, maybe pink eyes. Do I look cute? Do I? Primer. Foundation. Concealer. To everyone who's asking me how I do my eyebrows. I just dropped my eyelash glue on the floor, so this is probably going to be my last video with it. I'm thinking pink eyes, so I'm gonna literally jump in with this. This is a Wild Orchid from NYX. I'm going to add this um, into my crease area because I also feel kind of like red. I think. I feel like blending out this with something warmer, so I'm actually going to blend it out with um, this corally orange color. Just to add like a shadow of like orangey into the the edges. On the lid, I'm going in with Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette Lumber. Oh, pretty. I'm getting some serious rose gold vibes here. I 
For Ireland, I'm going to actually try out something a bit weird. I'm gonna do kind of a dragged out eyeliner, if I can manage anyways. And then I'm gonna try top it with something. But let me see if I can get the eyeliner out of the way. That's all I can do. Let's try to do the same exact thing here. Now, I had kind of a crazy thought in my head. I don't know if it'll look good or if it'll even work, but I have this kind of a, what is this, liquid glitter, kind of from Lime Crime. It's called Diamond Dew. I wanna see how it would look on the tip of my eyeliner or all over the eyeliner, except I don't know how it would look. Am I going to ruin it? Well, I can always cover it up with black. I got it into my head. We're gonna try it now. I'm not going to do it all over the eyeliner, but I do kind of like just the end part of it. I like it. I like it a lot. It looks a bit amateur. It looks a bit wild, but I, I actually like it a lot. For lashes, I'm gonna try experiment a bit and I'm gonna try these um, NYX Wicked Lashes in I don't know what, I throw away the box. Okay, I made some choppy attempt at that. Blush. For highlighter, I'm using this um, loose highlight, Live in the Highlight by Inglot, Jennifer Lopez, whatever. Oh, look how pretty, look how pretty. Inglot is quite pricey as a brand, but if you're gonna buy just one thing from there, buy this. <laughs> I think I overdid it a bit. Oh my god. You know what we're gonna do now? Brighten up those corners. I feel pretty. Oh, so pretty. Cause I'm covered in highlights so thick. That's so nice. Okay, I know I want to do pink on my lips, which is very rare, by the way. This entire look is very rare because I am not a pink person. At least not on my face. Uh, mm, this is Jeffree Star Gemini. Lime Crime Plushies in Rosebud. Mmm, it's too light for this. What if I go in lightly with Gemini as well? But that's not it, because this is a super shimmery look, so we're going in with gloss. Um, this is a MAC Dazzle Glass in Extra Amps. Finally, I'm going to finish off the look with some freckles really quickly. So starting with this eyebrow um, pencil by Max Factor. NYX eyebrow marker.
kind of a brown color and a stippling type blending brush. Press on to the skin. Don't rub though. Perfect. I'm gonna go finish off my hair um, real quick and then I'll be back. Hiya, I'm back. <laughs> so this is the finished look. Um, I'm actually really, really into the wig now. I had to do some changes to make it look less synthetic. I actually sprayed dry shampoo um, onto the roots because the roots, the black part was um, the most synthetic looking because it was so, so shiny. But I just sprayed some, some dry shampoo on it and it actually looks good it looks it looks cool it looks natural obviously this is like this is goals i mean it's like long long you know this is the completely finished look you know i actually really 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 like this look simply because it's so not me it's so not my style typically i'd go for a more almost daring wig color so blonde for me is actually a lot more toned down but i actually am loving this so much because it looks so natural and it looks so chic and it's so stylish and oh the fact that even the wig isn't completely straight it's got some like wave to it it's got some body some movement to it i'm actually loving it so much and then the entire makeup look is just it's just I used a lot of products that I normally wouldn't, but I'm really, really happy I did. I'm actually really, really happy with how it turned out. So, all the eyeliner I'm living for, ugh, it's just, it's just a combination of things that I love. I'm going to put everything down in the description box below. Um, this gorgeous wig is going to be there. This is the first time that I'm wearing it and I'm really, really super stoked with how it looks. Oh, I love it. I feel so queenly. This is my tiara. And this is my my halo. So this is going to be in the description box below. As I said, there is a coupon code that you can use throughout the entire website. So if you want, you can, you know, apply that on whatever wig. But this is just, oh, I'm, I'm loving this. All of the makeup is going to be down there. As I said, a lot of things, there are things that I wouldn't naturally use. But I'm actually loving it. So everything's going to be down in the description box below. This is my Ana Luisa necklace and these are my Anna Louisa um, earrings because I just uh, I feel so sexy I'm not gonna bother you any longer I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you will give it a go and I will see you in my next video